Hey, welcome back everybody. Today we're going to do a box break. And this is going to be a Junk Wax Era box break, 92 tops. We're all familiar with it. At the height of the Junk Wax Era, tops made their 92 base card set and forgot something when they did it. What did they forget? Ooh, look at that. It looks so fine, don't you agree? There's something missing from this pack and it's a piece of gum. I believe this is the first year the Tops did not have gum in the in the uh, bubblegum card packs. 792 cards in the set, overproduced, of course, in the Junk Wax era. First year without gum, but it's also the first year with Tops Gold Series cards and uh, winner cards that you could turn in to win some free stuff. No real uh, subsets in here, I don't believe. It's a 792 card set with... All stars and managers and players, all part of the base set. No real rookie cards to write home about. Manny Ramirez and Sean Green were hot at the time. Uh, here's an idea of what the cards look like. That's they did have some first draft picks, but again, these are not a subset. They're just part of the regular set. That's card 216, as you can see. That's the uh, standard issue card, and uh, there's the all-star, Cecil Fielder. Again, that's just part of the set. And then, of course, they had the uh, portrait cards, landscape cards. So, decent photography for the, for the era. 92 tops, base card set. We're not going to open the entire box today. We'll probably just open one corner, maybe nine packs. They're tightly packed in there. If you remember, I bought this box at the card show, first card show back, uh, I think it was in mid-June or early June, maybe. Maybe at the end of May, I did a video on it. And these boxes were $5 each. And if you remember, they had a whole case there of 20 boxes. I think it was either $75 or $80 tops. I think it was $75, which of course was $3.75 a box or even $80 or $4 a box. I should have jumped on that. I probably should have. Instead, I bought a 1991 Upper Deck set for $5 again. And I didn't, I spent my money on some singles. Anyway, without further ado, uh, let's get right into it. I mentioned the rookie cards of Manny Ramirez and Sean Green. It also has the quote-unquote rookie cards of Mike Mussina and Jim Tome. Uh, it's actually the first tops card, I guess you could say. Uh, Mussina was not captured in 90 tops. Um, of course, 90 upper deck and... Or, I mean, 91 Upper Deck and 91 Bowman and 91 Score all had Mucina's rookie card in there, but 91 Tops did not feature him. So this 92 Tops is actually his first Tops card. Same thing with Tommy. And, of course, we're looking for the Pudge Rodriguez. There's Mike Bilecki. He signs through the mail. I was just about to say we're looking through for guys who signed TTM or through the mail, autographs, seeking. Always looking at Joe Oliver signs. Uh, for guys who sign through the mail, Bobby Witt signs. He's a great signer. Said Landrum, I think I think Tony Black got him back one time. Todd Zeal, his, op his window was open very, very shortly this past uh, summer. Stan Javier, Mike Moore, Lou Sweet, Lou Whitaker, Todd Stottlemyre, Greg Maddox, Hall of Famer, Don Robinson signs, Tom Kelly signs, and Chili Davis is ghost signed, we all hear. Yeah, Pudge Rodriguez has a Gold Cup card. He's a Hall of Famer, of course. Uh, we're always looking for Hall of Fame cards. Just open these nine packs. Um, of course, it's filled with Hall of Famers. And we'll run across them and try to point those out as we go through and look at those. Top prospects to the foreheads. Uh, Henry Rodriguez there is uh, somewhat familiar. And Jared Williams had a decent career. Short-lived. Chris Nabholtz, I don't know if he signs or not. Bill Plummer, Bobby Bonilla, great card there. Kirk Dressendorfer signs. Hector Villanueva, Todd Froworth, Vaughn Hayes signs for $5 each. Hubie Brooks, as in the fat Elvis days, and Mookie Wilson. Anduhar Cedeno was a top prospect back in the day. Jeff, one of the best college players I've ever seen play, Robin Ventura. Jeff Treadway, Paul Molitor is a Hall of Famer, and Gary Templeton, who's signing through Pass Pros, I believe, is currently coaching in Puerto Rico, pretty sure, on their national team. 
All right. Next pack, Daryl Hamilton. Thomas Howard. Ron Karkovice. Kevin Elster signs for $2 each. Mark Langston. Scott Bales signs through the mail. Jose Mesa. Is he a member of the 1,000 uh, Games Pitch Club? I think he is. Jacob Brumfield, he was... G DJ Dozier played football at Penn State, I believe. Was hopping on that two-sport athlete train that was going by during that era. Steve Searcy's signed through the mail. Paul Ferry's, Jim Lindemann. Daryl Strawberry, that's a cool card. Rounding third and heading for home. Pat Mahomes, that's Patrick Mahomes, the quarterback's father. Pitcher for the Twins. Roger Sokol, Turk Wendell signs through the mail. Jim Leland signs through the mail. This would be perfect for Leland because he would sign a black ink in this black area and a very barely legible signature. <laughs> and you'd have to wait a year to get it. Other than that, it's a perfect CCM target. I didn't show you the backs, did I? There's the backs of the cards. Full of top stats, lifetime stats. And I'll show you one of the back of those forehead rookie cards as we get to it. Brian Bohannon, Lloyd McClendon, who became manager of the Pirates. There's the Manny rookie card. I'd like to see that. Scott Erickson was a stud back in the day. Dwayne Ward, Jeff Reardon signs for $5 each. Kevin Apier, Mike Jackson, Andy Stankowitz signs through the mail, I believe. Barbara Dejard, two Yankees. And there's the backs of those. Steve Sachs, move on, early card. Denny Jackson. Oh, let me tell you about Denny Jackson. Kevin Brown, Mark Williamson, and Craig Lefferts. Craig Lefferts. Is he signed through the mail? He may just do a C line, L line. I have to double check that. Saw some Jeff Russell returns. Saw him sneaking in there. Jim Clancy. He does not sign, I don't think. Andy Ashby. I'm going to try to double check on that. Brad Osmus signs, Campana signs, and Nilsson, let's see if it says he's from Australia. Yeah, born in Brisbane, Australia. Benny Santiago, Tony La Russa signs through the mail. He's a Hall of Famer. Don't know what's going to happen now that the season's ended because you used to just send it to the uh, Angels Stadium. Jeff Russell signs, Doug Jones signs. He's a really good signer. Pete Smith signs for a fee. Joe Gray. All right, four more packs. And we'll be done with this part of the video. Maybe we'll hit this every Wednesday and try to finish this box. wonder if I can put a set together with the two boxes I'm about to open. I already opened one. Kurt Stilwell signs. He takes a while. Bernie Williams could be a future Hall of Famer, even with the glasses from 1992. Whoop. Let's see if you can see those a little bit better. There they are. Boom, glasses. Kevin Tappan, he's been signing through the mail. 80 or 90 day return. Bill Wegman signs. Dan Pasqua signs haphazardly. There's Carlton Fisk. He's a Hall of Famer. Clemens will be. Smith, a little running Hall of Famers there. Brent Gates and Luis Gonzalez Gold Cup. Luis Gonzalez was signing about a year ago after about a year wait. He returned a bunch of them at the same time and then Hadn't heard a word from him since. Bob Scanlon. Hall of Famer Larry Walker. Kirby Hall of Famer Kirby Puckett. Dave Martinez. Saved wings. That's not a good sign. Unless he, unless he goes gold or silver on that card right there. Wade Taylor signs. Randy Myers. Alex Arias. Will Cordero. Chipper Jones. Prospect card. Forgot about that one. Glider. Alan Watson. Sandberg. Sandberg always had some good-looking tops cards, didn't he? Always jumping over it. Zane Smith signs. Yuri Bay and Winfield, record breaker. Oldest to hit for the cycle, 39 years old. Hey, two packs for me. Let's see if we can get through this. See if we can get another Man Ram rookie. Get that Mucina rookie. Or the Tommy. Rick Wilkins. Kenny Rogers Roasters. Tom Glavin's a Hall of Famer. Bagwell's a Hall of Famer. Well, they always come in twos. Barry Larkin, Hall of Famer. Mike Maddox, Brett Barbary signs. Ruben Amaro signs. 
Los Rivera, Mark Whitten signs one per, and will take any extras. Don't send him more than one. He will take it for his very own. And last pack for today, as we open one corner. Ooh, so there's Cecil. Cecil B. DeMille. Mackie Sasser has been signing through the mail. Haven't got him back. Roger, Roger Clemens base card. Look at all that red. League leaders. Dave Justice. Jose Guzman has been signing. Tim Wallach. Harold Reynolds. Scott Kamenecki signs. Damon, I found my thrill. Homebury. Andy Bennis. Denny Nagel. Greg Anthony. Is that a snake around his neck or is that just a funky looking sweater? Wow. All right. Bill Picota, and the last card for this day is Tim Leary. All right, we got a big stack of Hall of Famers and guys who signed TTM or through the mail. Take a look at that. And that's just in nine packs. Of course, the total value on these cards is probably a dime, maybe 11, 12 cents. <laughs> uh, but not bad. Always fun to look through packs like these. You don't have to worry about the... Um, Gum stains, you don't have to worry about a major rookie card being damaged with a gum stain. Or, uh, even with these packs, these wax packs, they're not truly wax this year either. Just, they don't damage the cards. They did a good job taking care of the cards. The kids missed the gum. I know I did back in 1992. Anyway, hey, thanks for watching. We'll be opening uh, another stack sometime down the, down the road. Stay tuned for some more TTM videos coming up tomorrow, I believe. And uh, we'll open some junk wax and we'll do some blind trades too i'm way behind on my blind trades thanks for your patience though everybody who sent me cards for blind trades i'm getting to them and i promise you i will give me a thumbs up let me know what you uh, thought of this down below and one click subscription right here make sure you hit that notification bell you'll be notified of all my future videos and then if you missed the most recent video i'll put a link to it right here you can one click and watch it again or watch it for the first time Thanks for being with me today. Thanks for watching. We'll see you soon.